Hi, in this video we're going to be talking about the Power Toys Always on Top utility. So this is part of the Power Toys suite of apps here that you could download and install on your computer. So I'll put a link in the description for it so you could go ahead and do that if you want to check it out. So it comes with a bunch of different things, but we're going to be talking about the Always on Top feature. So let's say you have something, you know, like an, a window that you always want to have in the foreground and always be on top of other windows so that way it never gets blocked off. So for example, let's say you're working on this brochure here and you have the headings and you want to, you know, go back and forth, but you don't want to have to, you know, reduce the screen size to try and fit them both on the screen. You just want to keep this on top. So the way this works, it's enabled by default when you go to it. And the default shortcut is Windows key, control T, and you could change it. Uh, then there's some other options to show a border around the pin window, which you'll see. And you could change it from the Windows default to a custom color, change the thickness if you want to have a round corner, and play a sound. And then you could also exclude some apps if you don't want them to be able to run on top. Okay, so how it works is, so let's say we want this one to run on top. We just select it, do our Windows key, control T. Made a little sound, now it puts this blue box around it. Like I said, you could adjust the color, the width, and the uh, corner thickness of that. So now, every time we click into here, it stays on top. So you can see I could go ahead and change this. And so on, and it stays on the top for me. And then if I open another window, you'll see it opens up right behind it. And that way I can't get block it off either. And so I could minimize it. And then when I bring it back, it still stays on top. And then if you want to undo this feature, just do the same key combination. Windows key, control T. So it makes a sound, now it's back to normal, and then it's not in front anymore. So once again, just download the software, go to always on top, it should be running automatically. Uh, you shouldn't have to do anything unless you want to change the settings, and you could come in here and check it out, and then go ahead and use it and keep your windows on top. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.